The first U.S. weather satellite is launched, a technology giant is born, and Google launches a new email service. It all happened this week in tech history. This week in 1797, Nathaniel Briggs of New Hampshire patented an early form of washing machine for clothes called the Box Mangler. It had a heavy frame containing a large box filled with rocks on a series of wooden rollers. Two people were required to move the box back and forth in order to clean the clothes. In 1951, this week, Remington Rand delivered the first Univac 1 computer to the United States Census Bureau. Univac 1, or Universal Automatic Computer, was the first general purpose electronic digital computer designed for business. This week in 1960, the first U.S. weather satellite, Tiros-1, was launched. The Tiros-1 satellite transmitted the first television picture from space, and meteorologists saw the first pictures of a mid-latitude cyclone over the northeastern United States. In 1976 this week, Apple Computer was founded by Steve Jobs, Steve Wozniak, and Ronald Wayne in a garage in Cupertino, California. Just two weeks later, Ronald Wayne sold his 10% stake in Apple for $800. That stake today would be worth $75.5 billion. And this week in 2004, Google announced a new service to the public, a project that up until then was known by the codename Caribou. The project's real name was Gmail and was originally thought to be an April Fool's joke. However, it was very real and quickly became one of the most popular email services around. That's our look back at This Week in Tech History, brought to you by IFA in Berlin. IFA, the Global Innovations Show. Meet the official partner of the future in Berlin. Hey everyone, Cameron Graveline here. Remember, call in Winstop. Thank you. Visit us online at intotomorrow.com where you can participate in our weekly Into Tomorrow radio program and win prizes. Catch you next time on This Week in Tech History.